What's going on everyone and welcome back to the channel. Lately I've been getting some questions on competition holsters for the Beretta 92X performance platform. So I went ahead and pulled out some of the holsters that I have used and I wanted to discuss some of the popular options that are out on the market and hopefully help others decide which holster to get for themselves. So let's take a look. All right, first up, I have a competition holster from Red Hill Tactical. You can see here that it's a pretty thick Kydex all the way around. They do smooth out and dremel the sides here. And this is for the 92X Performance platform. Um, it does fit in everything. However, I just am not a fan of how it fits. It seems like when they molded these, they didn't actually mold it to a 92X Performance. They just kind of made a uh, you know generic bucket type holder for this. You can see here it kind of moves. There isn't a ton of retention when you're actually, it just kind of feels a little sloppy. And again, it kind of just moves around. It does fit, obviously it fits the optic version here, fine. But it just doesn't feel like a quality holster. And then one other thing I really dislike is there's a lot of material right here. So when you're going to draw, you can, feel the kydex in the holster rather than the underguard of the trigger which i really dislike so uh no go for red hill tactical all right next up i have a holster by guga rebus this is a brazilian company so they import their products into the usa you can see here i have it on my links belt um this is their neo holster it's a universal holster so it does fit a bunch of different uh platforms you can see here there's an insert here and on, on the bottom that you can tighten and loosen depending on which gun you're using it does come with the hanger and everything so that's pretty cool it's a pretty quality holster it fits the 92x performance it's a very passive retention just because it is a universal holster so there isn't you don't hear any audible click it kind of you know sounds a little funny it's essentially a bucket but um it does work and it's cool because you can you know use it for a different a bunch of different platforms if you switch guns or whatnot my only complaint is this part right here where the actual insert sits um it's fine when you're drawing for uspsa or whatnot uh, you can get a good purchase on the gun and your finger kind of comes right under the trigger guard you know where you like it however when I'm shooting Steel Challenge or I'm drawing from Surrender and I'm bringing my hand down, it can get a little tricky because you kind of want to avoid this part here and get right in between uh, the grip and the holster and then get a good purchase. So not my favorite for that, but it's a good option if you're looking for something for a bunch of different competition pistols. All right, last up, I have a competition holster by Precision Holsters. Um, I actually got turned on to this company by a good friend of mine who uh, shoots Brettas as well, and this is the holster he actually runs. This is my favorite competition holster that I've found. It has kind of this double-layered Kydex. Uh, it is smoothed out and everything. It's um, not super thick, but not super thin at the same time. It, it can fit a bunch of different uh, hanger platforms. I have it on a boss hanger for my competition rig. And then it has these adjustable screws here that you can tighten the retention real easy. You can also get it with just uh, regular Phillips heads if you're shooting IDPA and you can't have these knobs on there. I don't know if that's still a rule or not, but you can get it in that configuration. It does fit the 92X Performance real well. You can see here, there's a really good retention. The draw is real nice and there's no wiggle there's no play or anything like that and the cool thing about this one is it fits the 92x performance the carry optics model obviously fits the standard version just fine but then it also fits the 92x performance defensive see here as well as if you have a 92 elite LTT fits that as well as just the standard, the standard 92 G. So it fits a bunch of different platform, 92 platforms. Um, I really like it. It's a real quality holster. You have a really good purchase under the trigger guard. You can see here, they cut it out real nice. So I can feel 
the underguard of the trigger, get a good purchase, and then a good draw. So I highly recommend them. This has actually been my favorite. I've gone through a lot of different holsters and Precision Holsters really did a good job with this one. Uh, I can't say enough good things about it. All right, guys, I hope that video was a little informative. I'll go ahead and link the holsters in the description box for you guys to take a look at. If you have any questions, go ahead and put them in the comment section. I try to get to the questions as quickly as I can. Uh, other than that, I'd really appreciate it if you guys subscribe, hit the bell for any notifications, and I will catch you guys later. Be well.